kissing people and being loved. Good luck. Peace, family. Peace, family. So I'm glad that we out here for this cause. You know, we talking about saving our schools, but we have to keep in mind that Cammy gotta go. She was sitting here with a mission. Her mission was to divide and conquer. And she thinks that she's winning. She keeps lying, she keeps lying, and she will continue to lie. They came up with this fiasco. They call it a One North plan. And I want to know, when did we have to do applications for our children to go to public schools? On my way down here, I was sitting on the bed, and I was like, dang, it's cold outside. I don't want to go outside. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. But I had to go. But I'm glad that I sat still enough. Because as I was thinking about it, you know, guys, we are you. they are using our North public school dollars to make commercials for charter schools. And so if, it, if nobody else is angry about that, I'm angry. Because I graduated from Hawthorne Avenue School, and I was a student at Arts High School, and I graduated from Weekway High School, and never once did I see a commercial for any one of my schools that I graduated from. So why is it necessary that we are using public dollars to, to, to push charter schools on us? Because we're talking about choices. So if we have a choice, then choose to make commercials for all our schools. Every single one of them. So she keep playing around with this money. Y'all know we just got $100 million about three weeks ago. Well, actually, they got it last year, but they was playing around with it. So it's $40 million floating around because she can't figure out where the rest of the money is. But we have $100 million that was distributed to Newark public schools as of last year. Federal dollars. So we need to ask Cammie, where's our money? She wants to take our children out of North Vocational High School, throw them into the West Side building, and their tracks can't follow them. The engineers have already been to the school, so will they not have culinary arts program? What, what else will they not have? Their excuse for taking our children out of North Vocational High School was that they didn't have money to bring the building up to par. So my question to Cammie and to Tiffany Hardrick, who I had the meeting with, if you don't have money to do the building for our students, where you finding the money to make this your new two-seater street? Yeah. You already put kids out of six buildings. Six buildings already. There are six empty schools sitting that we pay PSE&G, we have to pay exterminators, we have to pay somebody to sit and secure those buildings. You already put families out of commission. Why can you not move into those buildings? But the answer to that is because those buildings are being paid for by somebody else. Their business is making money. Our business is to educate our children and to leave our children with choices. So the bottom line again, if, and, and, and they keep talking about our schools are failing. Our schools are failing. Our children are up to par. Let me remind you that we have been under state control for 20 years. So when you're talking about our children failing, what does that say about the state? Because you can't pick on my child and not have, that doesn't have a reflection on the parent. So I want for my brown baby, because y'all been waiting, I want for my brown baby, and I know she wants for her brown baby as well. We all want for our brown babies. The black ones, the blue ones, the green ones, those that speak Spanish, those that speak whatever language we speak, we all want for our children the same things. We want quality education. We're not afraid of reform. We're not re afraid of reform. We do not want your reform, Carrie Anderson. We don't want what you're giving us. We don't want what you're demanding of us. And stop being so selfish and be and you done had a temper tantrum. You done told us you're not coming to the meetings no more. So we're going to keep bringing the meeting to you. Peace.